Welcome back, anybody. Uh, I'm sitting on my perfect cans that I made on a previous video. Um, we're going to find out now how perfect they really are. Um, the only problem I'm going to have is the last board coming off these cans is going to be one inch thick instead of three quarters inch, simply because of the limitations of my mill. So uh, I got a plan for that, and uh, hopefully it'll work. So let's see what happens. Believe it or not, I got that intro done in a single take, which has never happened before. This take, on the other hand, has taken three tries. So I'm sort of improving and then falling back. Here goes the video. This cant was the biggest one that I milled in preparation for making the fence boards. Unfortunately, it's mostly rotten, so I can't use it. What I'm doing here is cutting a one quarter inch thick shim that I'm going to be putting on the bunks. Then on top of the shim, I'll put my one inch boards, which will hopefully, when I mill, give me my one inch clearance that I need and also give me a three quarter inch board. If you pay close attention to this part of the video, you'll see why I try to use the quarter scale whenever possible. Using the quarter scale changes your unit of measure from inches and fractions, or centimeters and millimeters, to boards. So in this particular case, I'm converting my normal measurements into three quarter inch thick boards. The saw blade will cut three quarter inch boards out of the right hand cant. It'll then get down to the same height as the left hand cant and you'll see the blade skim across the top of the cant. Then we'll cut two or three boards from the right hand and the left hand cant. Then we'll skim across the top of the middle cant. And then continue on down until we are at the one inch thick height. For me, using the quarter scale eliminates the need to do a lot of math to try to figure out where to start so you end up where you want to end.
and there's my one inch bottom board that I'm going to have to resaw later. Notice that that left hand cant doesn't seem to be square on the bottom. Looks like somebody may have screwed up. Not me, but somebody. There's the quarter inch shim I milled earlier. Let's see if it works. Right here I'm checking the board for Wayne. Any Wayne I find on any board I'm going to have facing upward so that as I make my uh, three quarter inch cut, I'll get rid of the Wayne and end up with a nice clean clear board. probably think this part of the milling was tedious and boring. You'd be right. Well that does it for the boards, that does it for the video. Now I gotta build the fence. Thanks for watching and uh, please hit the like button whether you liked it or not and uh, consider subscribing whether you want to or not. Subscribing is free. Thank you very much. See you on the next one.